What's good, y'all? We talking about using our base defense to stop bunch formations. So the first thing I usually do is uh first thing I usually do is base aligned and press when they're running bunch formations. And then I like to shift my D line to the strong side and crash them to that side because if they run base or something, then I can feel. Second thing I like to do is always man up the point man. Like this guy right here, I always man up this corner over here on the point man because everybody you without that point man any bunt formation is really dead because they're on the ball for a reason because they run they run the deeper routes they run the routes that really gets open so that's what i like to do there uh and the other thing i like to do if they're running verticals like i like to man this guy up right here i like to man that guy right there and then from there you can you can stay like this just to see what they like to run so like i'm gonna see what they're running I'm going to watch the cross, so that's the only thing I'm watching. Y'all see every, how it locks up everything just by taking away that the the point man. The point man is the most important man in any bunch formation. What did I do? I don't know what I did. But like I said, the, the point man, like if you don't lock him up, you see how that's open? If you don't guard that. You take that away, you force them to utilize their other receivers. What did I do? Like I said, you force them to utilize your other receivers, therefore giving you the upper hand because you have all the uh, you have all the the leverage once you take away that point man. Because like we're gonna go back into our defense. Because let me, I'm gonna just show y'all the plays that are in Gun Bunch. I'm pretty sure y'all already know them, like Bunch Trail or like anything, like really, like Bears, like this Broncos cross. The point man is coming across first. Four verticals. That's the route everybody likes over the middle. And since you're art, like, yeah, we're just going to talk about verticals. So we're going to baseline and press when we see bunch. Shift our D-line to the uh, strong side and crash them to that side. We're going to man up the point, man. And what I usually like to do, is I like to uh, man up man up this guy on RB. Because people like to throw the flat route in Z-spot. And if they do run the verticals, the little wheel route, and they motion him out, like uh then there's not really a lot they can do because you got that soft squat right there and a soft squat will follow that guy so they really can't do nothing and then you got that guy i mean he's manned up so there's not much they can do so this stops any bunch just by manning up the point man and i like to man this guy up on rb especially in gun bunch week because everybody likes to throw that quick flat because if you're in a soft squat and you shade underneath and they run four verticals or they run at verticals, he's going to come down and that wheel route is going to get up the sideline. So you don't want to do that. So you just want to man up RB to take away that first uh, read on the flat route. And I like to bring him in a little bit just in case he runs a drag route. That's what I usually like to do. But it's really up to y'all. And you can use these two people here. And then you're going to see how it just stops verticals. And it's so dominant. And they can't do nothing against this base defense. So I hope y'all enjoyed this. Be sure to keep watching.